Studios and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The second half kickoff is a comeback in the cards in this one-sided affair. Nelson's not going to test the coverage this time as he takes a knee. The Cardinals talk things over at the intermission, and I'm sure one of the first orders of business was to try to figure out a way to get this offense going, Phil. Go. Absolutely. That's what you want to do, and I think you do that by play call. So the coach, they have many plays that we call drive starters. Catch the defense by surprise. They need to call one of those right here and right now to get this offense going. Here go. hey, hey. Ooh, five. The Cardinals take it from the 23. And the catch is made by Larry Fitzgerald. Third catch today so far. Well, that'll make you feel a little better. Finally getting a first down. You're down big in the second half, and you're on the offensive side. Don't look for the quick score. Just look to pick up positive go, yards here, and here, hope here. it leads you to a score later. First down and 10. Ellington's taking the handoff. The Cardinals running back that time. He makes a bad decision. You can't be looking to make every play a big play when you're running the football. Look for a few yards, take advantage of that. He tries the big play, what happens? He gets tackled for a loss. Second down and 12. Picks up eight here. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's gonna wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. The Cardinals snap it at the 36. That pass incomplete. Well, your teammates are really going to respect you after something like this. Anytime you're on that field as an athlete, and when you give all your effort to every single play like that time, how about that? Just giving every bit of effort he can to make the catch. Not able to get it, but what a job and effort. He'll have a chance for a return. And a run back of about four. The Ravens are enjoying a dominant time here as they've stretched their lead out with three straight scoring drives and showing no signs of slowing down anytime soon. As I watch this team, I sure don't see them slowing down. It's just that everything they're doing has been right on both sides of the ball. And when it's going like this, take advantage of it and try to keep it going in the right direction. Second down here. The Cardinals defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel, trying to power his way right up the middle. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Flacco's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. Pinnas tackled down at the 36. All right, coaches, don't get greedy. Be decisive over there on the sideline. Do what's best for your football team. Keep getting those first downs and letting that clock just keep running. You got a big lead here in the second half. Don't take any chances. Flacco's completed his last six passes. The final quarter underway now with this snap. They're able to move the chains after that last run. They want to keep feeding him the football. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. The Ravens break huddle and show a jumbo look. Williams got the catch and the first. That's his first reception today. I think the coach on the sidelines, he's going to be happy with every first down because he knows that's more time off the clock. When you're up like this, multiple scores in the second half, every first down just puts the odds in your favor of winning this game. 
running the football is a mindset, and it's one this team has today for sure. You can tell this was the thought process all week long by the offense. We're going to go out there. We're going to out-tough the other team and just run the football right at them, and it has worked well. Second down and seven. They hand it off to him again. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. What a good job by the running back that time. He reads the blocks very well, and he picks his way through there and picks up a first down. That's, that's nice. Joe Flacco will take it right from the center. He'll get it again. That's a gain of 10. But well, we know you can win the game, but just running the football, then you just run the football. Take no chances. Keep two hands around it at all times, and don't worry about the extra yard. First down at the 15. Very nearly intercepted. Well, that's a nice play that time by the defense. The offense is inside your red zone. you got to stop them from scoring. That was a good job of swatting the football away. Second down and 10. Handoff by Flacco. Well, Jim, if they got the lead. There's not much time left. Run the football on this clock. Keep it moving, and you can win the game. Take no chances. Don't jump off sides. Don't create a penalty and put two hands on the ball. Could have been intercepted. Things get tight down here in the red area. I got to give the defensive man a lot of credit, though. In position, sees the ball thrown, and is able to get that hand up there and knock it down. The Cardinals counted on the passing game early, but it slowed down after a hot start. Palmer's tried to adjust to the defense, but it hasn't worked out. Well, he's tried, but listen, there's nothing he can do about the offensive line. It's not been as sharp, and I'll tell you what, when an offensive line is not sharp, a quarterback's going to lose confidence. Going deep. And Brown is stopped there. Well, you're really in a tough spot, but that is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. Palmer's completion percentage, 70% on the day. And Brown is stopped there. The Cardinals signal for the timeout, and that's the first one they've used. Just a yard away. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Palmer's back in shotgun formation. The hit knocks the ball out incomplete. Ellington's one of those guys. If he drops a pass or makes a mistake on the field, he doesn't make excuses. He knows no matter what the circumstances are, if you get your hands on the football as a receiver in the NFL, everybody expects you to make a catch. Second and goal at the one. Has it. Touchdown. The late touchdown's not going to change the outcome of the game, but perhaps it's something to build on for next week, Phil. Well, it sure doesn't hurt. Sometimes when you score late in games, it does carry over, softens the blow of losing a little bit, and it can carry over into practice, and you sure hope it carries into next week's game. Spins out of the tackle. right there has had quite the day today and he's got to be considered as maybe the most important element in what appears to be a surefire victory in the making. Oh, listen, all day long, he was the guy out there making a difference. He was the star. You said it right, and it's been fun to watch him play. Blackos marked down at the 34. Well, Phil, I enjoyed the watch of the game with you, and how about a final thought about that victory? Well, you know, Jim, I wish I could say the same, that I enjoyed spending these last <laughs> three hours with you, but that's 